St John's in Newfoundland and Labrador is synonymous with fishing. Little neighbourhoods like Kitty Vidi Village, for centuries now it's been their main industry. But there is change in the sea air. For generations, the talk around the dinner tables here would probably have been dominated by the theme of cod. These days, though, it's got a little bit more of an artistic flavour. This is the Kitty Vitty Village Plantation, where we have our 10 artist studios. There are craftspeople working in textiles and ceramics. We have a jeweller, we have uh, somebody who's making prints. And these are all artists who have their craft uh, skills well in hand. Uh, this acts as an incubator to offer them some support and training in business skills so that they will become uh, successful entrepreneurs when they outgrow the space. I can see, you know, the collegiality. Uh, the collaboration between them in the three months we've been open, I can really see the growth in some of these artists already. The uh, local public are finding out about us and coming in and uh, everybody is really, really encouraging and supportive of the concept and they love the opportunity to sit and talk with the artists while they're working and to kind of gain an understanding of, of their medium and what they're working in. Well, I'm here with Laura Higginall, a ceramic artist, and she's going to show me have to throw a mug and who knows I might even have a go myself. Laura go for it what are we doing? So once your piece of clay is centered on the wheel you need to open the piece of clay. The next step is to start pulling up the walls. Now that is where I suspect it may all go wrong for me. <laughs> I'm using this tool called a rib to shape it now. A big part of this collective here, how useful is it for you as an artist to be part of this whole thing? I feel the biggest benefit to the plantation to me is I find it's a, it's a very safe place to start. Um, with the help and guidance of some of the more established artists, mm. um, I'm very new to it and I have a lot to learn in terms of selling, marketing, grant writing, applications, things sure. like that. So that's the biggest benefit I'd say to me is the collaboration and just the bit of the safety net that I feel here. So we have swapped seats, we have even swapped clothes within reason. What happens now? I think this is going very well indeed. <laughs> you know, I think you could probably get something out of that, couldn't you? Maybe a dog's dinner. This is the kind of place where it doesn't matter what the weather's like, and it's Newfoundland, so the weather is pretty remarkable all of the time. The village itself is beautiful, and there's just a lot of sense of community here. It's a beautiful spot to work and, and inspiring for all our artists. For some around here, though, there can never be too much water, and the fishing will never go out of fashion. Mm -hmm.